What's going on everyone? So I want to show you guys another meal prep that's only $25, $30 at most depending on your goals. It's going to last you about 4 to 5 days. Uh, something very uh, tasty is not bland at all. It has a lot of taste. Uh, the chicken stays very, very soft, easy to eat. And all you have to do is microwave it. And let me just show you guys uh, one of the meals that I'm going to eat right now. And how easy it is if you were to meal prep this throughout the week. As you guys can see right there, I have six meals left uh, already prepared from a couple days ago. And I'm going to have one of these. And I'm just going to add some brown rice to it. Uh, it already has lentils, but I'm going I'm to add some more extra carbs. And you know, show you guys how it looks right now. This right here is how it looks. Uh, six ounces of uh, chicken breast. Half a cup of uh, red lentils, some veggies, and brown rice is an option, guys, or even white rice. Uh, you, if you have a rice cooker, you can have it like ready, fresh, or whatever, or you could just like uh, prep it and put it in there. Uh, it's up to you guys, depending how many carbs you need. This is a cup. I need a little bit more, so I'm gonna add that on top. And then all I'm gonna do, guys, is just uh, microwave it and and have my meal. Easy, fast, and it's affordable. So, can't complain. I will put the macros for that meal right on the screen, guys. And in this meal prep, we'll be making a total of 12 meals just like that. And here's everything that we're going to be using. Everything should cost you less than $30, depending where you get it. Most of these products, uh, we got them at Walmart. You could find them somewhere else uh, in local stores near you. Uh, look around and, and try to save as much money as you can if you're on a budget and if you do find this video helpful guys you can support the channel and go to coffee.com slash alex los angeles and you could donate me and buy me a coffee and you know i could start making more videos like this you know i gotta get my fuel on so i can edit these videos and with your help it can be done it will be possible starting the meal prep guys let me show you how i cook the lentils a uh, great way to make it taste uh, really good uh add some onions uh, some carrots, you know, you can cut them up in little pieces. Uh, you could just have it uh, boiling right there, you know, just uh, warm. And then we'll add some seasoning like black pepper, uh, cumin, garlic, some salt. It, this all depends on your taste. Uh, you could add the different seasonings if you like it. Uh, you know, you could play around with that. And while this is uh, cooking, you could also be cooking your veggies, which I will show you at the end of this and you will get a nice thick taste like that and if you feel that it's sticking uh, to the pot you could always add water uh, a can of diced tomatoes uh, you can add for the sauce uh, wash your lentils uh, it, should, it should end up like that clear water once you you know nice uh, clean completely and then you can add them in there and once they're done it takes a couple minutes uh, they should look like something like this uh, it shouldn't be dry at all uh, that way you can actually enjoy them and you know just uh, separate them for your meals and right here guys as, uh, as you can see this is the veggies that I'm going to be uh, using stir fry uh, use two of these uh, each has about seven servings each so you're getting a lot a lot of veggies uh, it's easy it's simple and I'll put the macros uh, for these two meals on the screen uh, that way you guys can see uh, you know what, what what it gives you for these uh, two foods right here if you're having a hard time with cooking chicken, you know, you get tired of it, I do recommend you follow these steps, guys. As you can see right here, I'm using paprika and some chili mix, uh, some gram masala. You could use different seasonings if you want. Uh, but just, you know, cut up some onions, uh, you know, let them cook very well till they get brown. And at the seasoning, uh, you could on the side be, you know, uh, cutting your chicken in small pieces. That way it's a lot easier to eat. Uh, you know, clean them very well. And then you could... Uh, throw them on top once all the seasonings and the tomatoes on top. Uh, chicken is always a problem, man. Because like if you cook them too dry with no seasoning, no flavor, uh, you're going to get tired and you most likely end up getting tired of your diet. Uh, so this is a great way. Uh, that's cumin right there. If you want to add that to, to your seasoning, it's up to you. Uh, gives it a very, very great taste. That way you get that chicken curry taste. And that's what we're making right here. Uh, we're going to use some uh, diced tomatoes. Uh, feel free to use as much as you like. It's very low in calorie and it will give you a nice thick taste uh, to the chicken. And then you can, you know, sort it out. And uh, right here we're using uh, a cup. 
I say, and, and then we'll just, you know, make sure that, that we're evening it out on every container. For breakfast, I'll give you guys two options. Uh, right here we have protein nut milk, which has 10 grams of protein for eight ounces, one cup. And you could use as much oatmeal as you like to get an extra five or more grams. Easy 15 grams of protein right there, guys. And you could have two servings if, uh, let's say you're a bigger guy and you need some extra protein. Uh, real good breakfast and the nut milk makes it taste really, really good. And the same uh, breakfast that I showed you last time with the kale and avocado, if you have you know trouble getting in your greens, uh, something fast and easy that you can pair is this, guys. You know, have some avocado, have some kale, a banana, and of course, put them in zip, uh, Ziploc bags, and then you could just put them in the freezer. That way, when you wake up, you know, you make that shake. Uh, you could use protein, any protein brand you like. Uh, you know, you could change it up and right there guys, you can have a green smoothie or you can have the oatmeal depending on what you crave that day. The easiest part of the meal prep guys is cooking the rice. You could use uh, brown rice or white rice. If you have a rice cooker, you could just, you know, put it in there, add some water and it will cook itself. It's easy. You know, you could cook a, a whole bag and it will last you five days or more depending on how many calories you need. Uh, and that's basically it man it's simple easy fast and for those of you that find it helpful please like the video share it comment below share it with somebody uh, support the channel guys and of course if you guys need help coaching online I do offer custom meal plans to fit your specific body weight and goals and you can email me at azxangelesayahoo.com anyways I will be bringing more of meal preps full day of eatings and of course uh, some workouts in the future Anyways, guys, hold on to the channel, and I'll talk to you guys next time.